Good morning. Today is Friday, May 14th. We've made it through the week. Congratulations. Um, sorry, I, I should have picked up my Bible. This morning, I want to share with you um, a thought. It says, uh, this is from Psalm 63. Oh God, you are my God. I seek you. My soul thirsts for you. I think about that and I um, wonder the ways that we at Park Hill seek God. How do we do that? And I have to tell you that I believe that one of the ways that we seek God is by seeing the divine and the humanity in one another, which allows us to see God on this earth and in one another. And it is a beautiful thing when we do that. And one way that we do that is by getting to know others, by learning about other people um, that aren't like us. And one of the ways we do that is with our book club. I have to say we had our book club meeting last night and um, you know it was just a beautiful conversation. Um, we read um, a book called Tomorrow Will Be Different by Sarah McBride. It's about transgender issues and we all learned a lot. Um, Sarah was so open and transparent about her journey um, to be a transgender woman and she answered questions that we had um, so openly and we found it to be really a great book. And um, it really opened up an area of social justice issues that we did not know a lot about. And sorry, my, I thought my dog was gonna knock it over. But it, it was great. And so then I thought, you know what? I wanna share some of the other issues, the other way that we seek God, the other books that we've read. We started with um, Evicted, you know, a book about people who are evicted. We've read books about prisons, about immigrants. Um, uh, we've read novels about immigration. We've um, read a novel about what it is to be an indigenous woman. Um, and then we've read books about race. Uh, we've read Tanahashi Codes and Ijeoma Olowu, um, Austin Channing Brown, and of course Ibram X. Kendi. Um, I recommend all of these books to you, all of them. And then this is what we read last night. Tomorrow will be different. Um, our book list is out on our website. Um, you can go to the website and pick any of those books. All of them have been fabulous. And the last book I want to tell you about is this little booklet. It's called Guide to Being a Trans Ally. And um, it, is, it was published by P. Flagg, which means parents, family, and friends of lay and gay and lesbians. And this is a little booklet that we have available at the church. If you um, want to just step into what does it mean to be transgender and how can I help? This little booklet is a wonderful place to start. Um, it is only 69 pages and it's an easy read full of information. So go to the church and pick up this little book, uh, Guide to Being a Trans Ally. Whatever you do, keep reading, keep seeking God in others. That's where we find God. And um, I hope you have a great day and a good weekend. And um, we will see you on Sunday. Bye.